Hello and welcome to episode three of my l of my Cities in Motion two map editor series. So episode two, we did a f my first ever time lapse, which hopefully was it was all right. I would admit the was the music was not th the best. I've been looking around on on s for some more. So hopefully, if I do any more time lapses, which there'll be one in this one, because I'm just gonna get straight into it. So. What I'm going to be doing is I'm just going to be finishing off some of the um, of the fine tuning here because I know it's just a bit it, in some places it does look a bit weak, for example there. But anyway, I'm finishing that up and I'll be doing and uh, doing the, some more of them hills around the edge of the map. So cue the time lapse. Hello and welcome back. Um, so, what I did was basically continue the mine there. I got, I've come across a problem here. If you've, you've probably guessed. I'm trying to, trying to mask it up now, which this is a good idea. It's not as dark as the others. Like make that dark a bit thingy like that. Make something like that, that'll work. You can still see off by a mail, can't you? So, but I'm sorry about this, but I've never, I did, I did not anticipate this to happen. But anyway, one thing I'm thinking of doing is focusing my area of building to, just for the, just for the, just for the prem, premise, the purpose of showing actually what, what we're actually going to be doing and what sort of building, building roadworks and stuff, road, road layout and stuff like that. Be focusing this area for the moment of time. So this, so this is the south west of the city, and. When we look at the map, there's two motorways going inwards to where they commit the meet, and then they're going towards the the city centre. I think what they're doing is the motorways. One will be coming from the stein from where the river is, and look along there, and then another one down here where there's going to be a town in here, like a main, like a main, like a main commercial area. Then the thing's going to come down here. This is going to be the airport area down here, and then the rest of it's going to be all that. So what I'm thinking of doing is creating the motorway first, the main motorway. What I'm thinking when it goes over the bridge, over the river, it's going to be elevated. Well, yeah, I know it's going to be elevated in the first place. What I think is like make it elevated, so then it looks like they've made they've made a road clearance. They built it purposely so like, like in the few in the few, like say like like this were built many years after than the other ones in the city centre. 
It's sort of like they built the road clearance for, for boats. No ones with tall masts and stuff like that. So that's what I'm thinking of doing. And also it provide a good area for the motorway junction to be made. Because one thing is, because since it's too close to this this section of the river, I'm create a trumpet. But I'll show you what I mean. I'm going to show this one because I'm not going to time lapse this one because I feel like I need to show you this. One. So, two of that up, like that. So it's eight meters up. Because it's, it's in every four. So, does it look like. No, we're both dead on. We're dead on. No, no level jet. And for the people who may have been asking why in my first video in the, the actual building part. The first video, um, I um, lowered the terrain and then re-raised it because I may want to pull like an underground metro, or you may want to, or a road if you want to. Because what I want to do is for the inner city, make it a bit, a bit, make it seem like the more where the ring road was actually built with expansion in mind, but other ones weren't. So I want to make you do some work with the, the, the with the city when it's fully built. So you go expand, well you go like, you go extend the motorway or like improve, like extend, ex um, widen it to make it four lanes to three, which you can do, it's not, it's your sure choice, I'm just giving these like things, which, uh, it's just, it's sort of like I want to try and engage with you, but it's not, it's, I am actually doing it for a purpose with this. So I'll continue it a tad bit, like to there I think. Um, please be warned, like some things I build on the video may be changed off camera. Like they did, like they did with the original, with the, with the first, with Season Motion 1 map editor. So don't be expecting some things to stay the same. Oops, forgot about that. No height difference, okay, that's good. What I'm thinking of doing is lowering it now, the um, road, the motorway here, so then it can come and connect up to around there, like that. We'll do the same for this side, just needs to be here. Anyway, if you have any suggestions, like I said, don't be afraid to say them. Don't be afraid to. I'm saying because, well, heck, I'm always, I'm always wanting some. I'm always wanting some suggestions because I want. No, I'm just not. I'm not going to explain it again because I've explained it too many times now. And also, he's probably getting bored of me saying it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to build the mall with the ring road around the area first and then build junctions off with some like town. I'm probably going to have some housing estates on the edge of here. With like a road, with like road bridges across the motorway, the main motorway to get to them. So that's how that's going to work. The thing I'm going to do is create the on ramp for here. What do you think? Let's have a look, see what it does. When it does that, does it make it look awful? No, it doesn't actually. Surprising, which is good. Apologize if you have anything weird. It's just, just me. <laughs> It's a bit of a wide one, must be said. 
I may, I may change it later. But I kind of like I kind of like it already. Like the wideness, because I always build too many Cramptons, and then I'm, then you can't upgrade them, which is my issue. Because I want them so that so they are also also able to be upgraded. You can create a longer slip rod for this one because, well, because we can do. Oh shoot! Yes, yeah, that's, that's a very chubby trumpet. Must be had. Yeah, that's okay. I'm not too fussed with it. But that is a bit close. I will say straight away. Oops! I keep I keep clicking wrong things. There we go. That's better. I want it to start curving now. So it's about here. Pardon me. So we can just connect it up to like this. See what you think about that. So basically, we, I'm, I'm I'm trying to. If the, I'm not gonna use every every more with I um, drew on the plan map to um, follow that. To I'm not following that to the specific thing. It was just a rough guideline and rough thing to show what I was gonna build. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna now I've shown some things on slow way. What I'm thinking of doing now is. Um, I'll extend this moat with us because this is going to be a one that goes in far. I'm not going to create that other one actually now thinking about it. So this is going to be like a main motorway for the southwest. So theoretically it's a bit like the M3. So. Um, just, a, just a little bit of a like a sort of like a history thing of the M3. Originally, at the at the, the southern the so, the um, southern end of it, before um, before the Win it's, it's Winchester, yeah, the Winchester bypass was built. That southern section was originally going to be called the M31, and then and ba and basically originally the uh, A3 was going to be upgraded to a full motorway all the way down to Pl uh, Portsmouth, Plymouth, jeez, Portsmouth, and that was going to be called the M3. So it's a bit of a trivia for you. But anyway, I'm going to create a, a, a roundabout here, a roundabout junction here, and there'll be a road off, and then I'm going to do a time lapse of me building a bridge, uh, there's to be a bridge over here with some housing estates here. Because I've, you have, I'm sure you've seen how to do some things. I'm just trying to speed it up and add more content in one video than I can do. So anyway, I'm going to stop talking and cue the music again.
I'm back. I'm, I'll finish that off later, but I just wanted to um, just to express like how some housing estates are going to look. You, uh, for me, I'm a person who likes plopping my my things individually. I've created that, and there's a little space there for when you come to play this game. There will be an like uh, come to play this map. There will be areas for, for for you to build roads on. Like little areas, little mini areas like this, just to build like new housing if you want to expand the area. I'll I'll finish this off camera because I don't want to because the, the time lapse will go in like 15 minutes because it took five minutes just me to do this bloody roundabout junction. But anyway, the, we're going to be round here is going to be like your main your commercial area for this area for the southwest of the city. I think I'm going to do some work on the um, on the trumpet because the, the slip roads coming are going north, going um, northbound, and the southbound exit. That is okay, but it's the northbound exit and the southbound entrance ramps. They're basically the, these ones here. I'm going to redo because they look a bit wrong. Look a bit weird now looking at it. But the other two, they look fine. Yeah, no, that one's shorter, but. What do you expect? You're not having cutting up bridge, do you? Anyway, there's sort of it. There's sort of like the housing estates I was thinking of. I thought I like, can um, make it mix it up and put like ones with like some tower blocks in, you know, like some block area there, and then there. I didn't want them at the back, as you as you did see. So anyway, I'm gonna end this video here actually because I'm gonna do the rest of that off camera and then. I've done that, done that, I think done that on camera and stuff like that, on, on live commentary, should say. But anyway, what I'll do is I'll do that off camera and then I'll move this more way up, further up. E even have the little cut, uh, cut through the mountain a bit. Because I want my, that's the reason I was doing the time, the, the first time that's of this video. I did that because I wanted like to make it look like a bit real. But using that as the natural border, sort of like, you not know, like a way of not making it seem like it's encased in a mountain in a way. Because cause when producing maps, like producing maps, i.e. like say like in Call of Duty or maybe other, other shooters that have small areas, small maps, which you like you confine to a space. They have to create like objects on the edge of the map just to make it look like you don't, isn't, there's not a sheer cliff off. No, cause, because actually the map tile does end there, but they're floating objects, but you can't do that in this game. So basically what you do is you create mountains with trees and stuff like that to make it seem like you're not just going into the going into the abyss. To the mist. And there's no there. Like a void. So anyway, I'm going to stop rap rampling saying weird stuff. So what I'll do is I'll do that mo put the motorway along there like I said extend that north a tad and finish off through these housings in here and maybe lay out the road here and then I'll do some actual I'll show some buildings actually me building some on the camera for the next episode so I hopefully you have enjoyed this episode to see that I'm finally moving and I'm really liking the way I'm using the ring road as the as like my um, way of like binding it together so far because that really works. I would admit that is a bit straight and a bit that bend is very very thingy but don't worry there will be some kinks in it to make it look more real. Where basically like it bypasses a village or like, but it does a bypass or something because that's what it should really do. So anyway what I'm gonna I'm gonna end this video here now because I'm waffling yet again. So don't forget to like favorite subscribe whatever you want to do with it because whatever you want to do because it's appreciated anyway. And I'll see you next time in whatever video may be uploaded. So, my name has been Anti HS Leeds, and as always, see you.